moved into this apartment I was moving in alone and I was looking for a roommate so I put an ad up on Craigslist and guess who answered it me that's how that we met a very <laughs> good ad you said like the word rad you said you were cooking oh. and I was like yeah I lied about bad. the cooking and then she messaged me back and she was very funny and then <laughs> we met and she was super cool and we, we talked to on be... this very floor for like hours I was so excited called my mom long story short didn't choose me I said let's be friends and I said dang then we would text um for the next five years on and Just off talk each other and never actually met up but talk about it a good bit and then finally this past November I slid into her dms and she agreed to meet me in human life and then I was like do you still live in that apartment I finally came full circle and I was finally allowed to move in I would say this is the longest con long con I love this place the other day um I was talking to one of my coworkers, and she was like I love your guys' studio and it made me realize that I take a lot of pictures of my plants but never really show around the whole apartment. So we're gonna give a little tour of our home and um, highlight a few of our favorite things along the way. Why not? <laughs> I'm going to show you my favorite area. There's a bug. Got it. This is the area that we just redid. If you don't know this rug, it's soft. This is a really cool new picture. We did this. This is a closet that I woke up in. Everything we don't like just goes in there. Most importantly, my shredder. Okay. Then we segue into the kitchen, which is a really good time for so many reasons. This is where all the food lives. A few key items. Pickles, Diet Coke, you know what I'm saying, ranch, critical cheese. This is my dog Chase. Shared custody with my parents. That's a picture of myself and the other one. This chops bugs. <laughs> Rocket ship full of candy. Super dope. That's pretty much the kitchen. Now we're gonna go check out my plants. This is my beloved fiddly thing. You know, I check on her every morning and we talk and gab. I have a rotating sort of plant family here. Some of them move to our room, some of them move back. Some need to be turned and shipped around, so they're kind of just all over. We have our humidifier on because we've got some calatheas here and a begonia that I brought back from the dead. If you turn around, you'll see this crazy vine that has grown up along our wall here. And this is a silver philodendron. If you look, it is humongous and it snakes all the way around the apartment and it all just comes from this tiny little pot right up here. Come with me to the bedroom. Okay. So Molly wouldn't let me hide the dogs. <laughs> so that's Dylan. And then this is new. Molly says, when you see a dog toy, you buy it. <laughs> and then we sleep with this. <laughs> this is an animal that is a literal dog toy. Like a disclaimer, I had no Say, Such a good purchase. Okay, so let me show you some plants. This is actually a Hartley Philodendron that has grown so much since I got her. You can see the leaves look like pretty little hearts. Can you see that? Hmm. Yeah. Bought this alopecia. I love him. You do? Yeah, he feels good. He looks cool, right? And he's really bringing home the bacon he's for really us. Bringing. This is this Oxalis and in the mornings, they open their leaves and at night they shut down. So now that they don't have sun, they've all like kind of shuddered. And I just think it's the coolest plant. They've shuddered? Yeah, do you remember what it looks like in the day? <gasps> oh, wow. Yes, right? 
they you've like literally they closed fold business. in like little tents. They're like they look no. like little origami. The last but not least is our beautiful monstera. She's growing all sorts of new leaves. We did have a mealybugs incident, which oh, several. <laughs> Yeah, well, it was a series of attacks. It was two. It was two attacks. One earlier in the summer, and I thought that I got them all, and then they came back, and so we lost a lot of the lower leaves. So you'll see her. She's a little bit top heavy, but we've got this is a new leaf this week. Look at this huge thing right here. Sometimes I roll over and a leaf is in my mouth. This is our plant mirror that I make Molly take selfies I've with me in. <laughs> Well, that's it. That's it. Thanks um, for tuning thanks. in. Thanks for watching. Tell them to like subscribe or something. Oh yeah. Isn't that what you're supposed to do on YouTube? We, could you subscribe maybe? <laughs> <laughs>